She done gained weight through the year. Uh -huh. You know, we could be sleep. You know, and I wake up, you know, I hear chopping and, you know, eating. Now I look over and see, she's not eating an apple or orange, Judge. She eating a full course meal. I'm talking about laying a down steak, mashed potatoes, everything. She's the judge who gives rules on the law and life. She's intense with common sense. She's Judge Lynn Toller on Divorce Court, where real couples deal with real life. Alicia and Derek were high school sweethearts who thought they had found forever love. But on their 23rd wedding anniversary, Alicia asked Derek for the best present she could think of, a divorce. I don't want it. He's just like a mosquito. Uh, you know how a mosquito bites you? She yeah. said that. And it just takes the blood out of you. That's yeah. how he is. She keeps the house clean. But if you go to a car, now it, it ain't no telling what you might find. Your Honor, if you want some chicken, it's chicken bone. You know, it's Your Honor, he's lying, like he's that. lying. It's not I be so scared that I think a snake gonna jump it's out of Can Derek talk Alicia into staying for the sake of their 23-year marriage and two children? Or will Alicia hold her ground and use it to walk out the door? Today on Divorce Court. All rise. Court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Lynn Toller presiding. You may be seated. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here today with Alicia Burney and Derek Davis. Ms. Burney and Mr. Davis, you have been married for 23 years. I've been, you married in 89, didn't you? Yes, ma'am. Because I've been married 23 years, <clears throat> too. <laughs> That's a good thing, Jim. Yes, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. She didn't, it didn't <laughs> sound good to her. You are, you want to end that quarter of century marriage here today. And when we do so, you have some financial issues you want me to resolve. But before we get to that, Mrs. Bernie, I'm going to ask you, why do you want to end a marriage that's almost been a quarter of a century? He's cheap. Cheap. Lazy. Lazy. Children. We deal with them different ways. Mm-hmm. And, you know, sex, I'm just not uh, into it. Now, hey, just talk, wait, I mean, wait, we haven't been out here three minutes, now. and she has, <laughs> has disparaged <laughs> every part of your character from top to bottom. Why don't you tell me? Let's, let's, let's start with the part that scares me most, which is the sex life. Tell me about that. It's just that, you know, whereas if, I mean, it's good, but it's just, uh, so I don't want to mislead him. I'm just not interested. I mean, it's like too little too late. We've been married too long, and it's like uh, the kids are gone. I just don't want it anymore. I just want the relationship, the I, marriage. I don't understand that when the other day, hey, you was happy. You know, okay. I, I was just horny. Part of the way, <laughs> I was just that, horny. That the bills get paid. I was just horny. That's Let's be true about that. That's the bills get paid. So, so I don't now, now, now let's get this saying. clear, Mr. Bernie. So, so, so Mr. M Ms. Davis, Mr. Davis can walk out of here with his head high. Mm -hmm. Most definitely. You have no complaints with the product itself. No, 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 no. So he's, he's delivering oh, pussy well. Down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but you're just saying you're at an age and a time where your interest in the whole thing and the is, marriage is diminished. And him. OK. Interest. Oh, no, OK. No, no. You, you know well, you... tell me about him being useless. You said he was useless. Useless. OK, whereas if, for example, the other day I asked useless. him, I said, well, could you, you know, I had cleaned up the whole house and yeah. everything. And I asked him, I said, well, could you hoover? Oh, no. Oh, no. And I'm telling him, if I'm going to do it by myself, I might as well be by myself. Why should I hoover? He he's at home all day. And he's the other two. I, I don't understand. Now, now I you're do, working. I do work and I come home. And I, I make sure everything is taken care of. You know, I take care of her. I make sure the bills get paid, everything. Mm -hmm. But I don't feel like I should do any kind of housework because she at home all day. OK. So far, Mrs. Bernie, I'm just going to say, okay. you coming up a little light in here. Okay. So you got a man who got a job. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking good. I'm doing it now. 23 years. And I got and the I sex is still okay. Mm -hmm. And the, so far, the only thing he does is not Hoover. And then he cheat, Your Honor. Well, tell oh, me about how he cheated. He had yeah. told me he was like, you know, well, go get your hair done. I said, okay. Then I went and go and get my hair done. Then he was like, well, how much money do you have? I was like, nothing, you know. Well, you spent all that money on getting your hair done? Okay, well, you should have been specific of what you, you said. You say he's cheap about that? Let me, let, let, let me define cheap okay. for you. I go to the drugstore, and I get some olive oil perm, 
and I go to this one drugstore because instead of eight forty nine, it's seven thirty nine. I take it home. I, I understand. Seven thirty nine. See, but that's your hell yeah. <laughs> Tell me about the discipline, the, the, oh. the disagreement you two have about disciplining the children. Okay, well, I have a 21-year-old and I have a 19-year-old. Okay. And they both are grown and they're on their own. Right. Okay, whereas if, if I ask him, you know, uh, they come and, you know, every now and then they'll ask me, you know, mama, uh, like my daughter, for example, she had paid her rent and everything. She was like, well, mama, is there any way that, you know, uh, I, we can give, give me some food? And I was like, okay, you know, fine. Oh, he's like, oh, no, you don't want to do it. But if he, she asked him, oh. Okay. He fly in like Superman. Okay. okay, first of all, I put it like this here. They want to be on their own, and they going to be on their own. My daughter is 19, my son is 21 going on 22. And they over there every weekend. They, from over your house, house. No, no, house. no, From Friday hey, to that's Saturday. That's a lie. That is a lie. They not over there every weekend. They, the when heck? they come over, no, okay. <laughs> when they not here, oh, he's hollering. I Have don't you know what she's talking about. Where I just the ran kids? Two Have you talked to the kids? But if they not, if they there, oh, when they leaving, when they leaving. Okay, which oh, one yeah, is that now, if you do and that if you don't? When they here, you know, I want them gone. And then when they go, you know, I, sometimes you I want, want them one, back. But, yeah. but you first know. of all, I want to applaud you two for getting your 21 and 19 year olds out of the house. Oh, a lot yeah, of yeah, people can't right. manage. <laughs> oh, they had to go. You know, they had. a lot of people can't manage it. They got kids, 32, 33, sitting at home, oh, no, no, wondering no. why dinner isn't made. So, right. so no, no. Okay. For you. I mean, absolutely. When divorce court continues, what does Derek have to say? Mr. Davis, I, you have you, you said something uh, in your papers Chris. that's gonna make her mad, and probably all the women watching mad. Oh, oh no, he did. Uh, okay. Is your spouse ready to walk out the door, but you want to try and save your marriage? Call toll free at 1 877 311 2222 or visit our website at divorcecourt.com or become a fan at facebook.com slash divorcecourt. Divorce Court is back with the case of Alicia Burney who wants to divorce her husband after 23 years of marriage because he is cheap. But is Alicia at fault for the demise of this marriage too? You say you don't like it because she eats in bed, her car is filthy, instead of laundering clothes, she likes to buy new ones. So basically what you're telling me, she's just kind of lazy. Oh, Explain yeah. that to me. Wait a minute, wait a minute. No, 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 no like it's Mr. Davis's turn. I'm gonna put it to you just like this here. Now, if you go out, okay, she keep the house clean, but if you go to a car, now, it, it ain't no telling what you might find. You gonna find coats and you know, if you want something to wear, it's going to be, you know, clothing, hats, and, and then if you want something to eat, you're going to find you some just look in the back. Oh, it's going to be it. Your Honor. If you want some chicken, it's chicken bones. You know, it's Your Honor, he's lying. Like he's that. lying. It's not even I'd be to so that scared screen. that I think a snake going to jump it's out. It's not of even. Now, he's talking about mine. I clean it to my expect to his expectation. He he's wanting to complain about it, but like I told him, you a man like the oil change. He don't want to do that. I do oh, all. He it. said when I you drive the it. car, you get the oil change. Why is that? I do it all for my car. I don't need him to do for my car. You know, but it, it's like everything that he does, you have to. He has to say what he done. You mm -hmm. don't do it from the heart. You do it from the mouth. Every time he does something, even if he do it from the kids, if they don't do what he wants them to do, he'll turn around and say, Oh, remember when I did this for you? Uh, Why did you do? things if you didn't do it from your uh, coin. He's yeah. keeping score. He oh, let everybody most definitely know. that. He he he's keeping it, he's counting it down, he's keeping it all tied up. I, I don't see nothing wrong Mr. with that. <laughs> because <laughs> if I do it, I do it. Well, you know? Why do you have to say what you done? I said what I done because that's what I did. But that's so crazy. <laughs> you know, because you did it. But why is you saying it? If you're going to do it from hey, the heart, hey. you shouldn't hear it from the mouth. Like so I evidently, said, you didn't do it from I'm, the heart. I'm going to do what I have to do for my family. I'm oh going to do my for you. I'm going to do it for the kids. Because oh, I'm to do. divorce court, baby. So he is not telling the truth. Oh. Oh. Mr. Davis, I, you have you, you said something uh, in your papers Correct. that's going to make her mad. Oh, no. And probably all the women watching mad. Oh, my goodness. So, so just, you said she's, she's too fast. 
Oh. Oh, no, he did. I, okay. No, I, he I, did. I put it to you like this one. Baby, you. I am picking no, the no, way for beautiful in the face. Okay, let me, let me put it like this here. <laughs> when we first got married, okay, we've been together for 25 years. Right. Married for 23. Right. So, at me, I seen her at her sexes. I'm talking about beautiful, you know, slender. If he and then she was a size four. Mm -hmm. And then she done ballooned up to a size 14, Judge. I'm sorry now. You know, so she done gained weight through the year. Uh -huh. You know, we could be sleep. You know, and I wake up, you know, I hear chopping and, you know, eating. Now I look over and see, she not eating an apple or orange, Judge. She eating a full course meal. I'm talking about laying it down. Steak, mashed potatoes, everything. First of all, And Judge. I be, I be mad, you know, go put that stuff up. First but of I, all, Judge, I say, like... you know, I tell you what, go on, give me some of that, too. You know, see, he's not going to eat. First of all, Judge, I do not sleep with him. I sleep on the couch. So that's a lie right Why there. Why do you sleep on the couch? Because the fact is that he, he's very uncomfortable when you sleep with him. I'm just going to put it like that, where he is. And you know, and all that, you know. Man, I don't want to be doing all that. You, know, you be doing all this. Oh my goodness! All the so I don't sleep with him. I sleep on the couch. Everybody and then my, I sleep in the uh, so, 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 Explain to me again what he's doing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm trying to hear all that all through the night. Then he doing like that. So for him saying that I eat all through the night, that, 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 that is a lie. And good. That's human nature. Everybody, that know, ain't you know. That ain't human nature, good. That's I about get all these things going oh, wait, on. Wait, 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 I give her respect. <laughs> I give her respect. So what, what do you have to say? Now, and I'm going to say this, and I, I'm a woman, too. Uh-huh. Been, been up, bit down on, on the thing, and I get all Come of on. that. And my husband, he, he baby, a, a couple of times. Do you understand that men are very visual people? My my mother's advice to me was, he, he does indeed have to love you no matter how big you get, but it would behoove you to look as good as you can so he continues to look at you. If he leave me, I can lose it. Because then, too, you know, I have a peace of mind and that's priceless. Well, that with ain't him, no, it's just that stress. Ain't for it's just touch. stress. I'm it's not just going stress. nowhere. I don't have to deal oh, with him. Sounds good. Na, 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 in my it ear. Sounds good. You know, na, 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 in my ear. That's all he want to do is na, 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 na. You know. Well, what is he na, na, na in your about anything? Oh, you yeah. know, what are you on? Oh, who are you at? Oh, what are you doing? Oh, man, oh. you know. Nah, nah, nah. I don't put no handcuffs on her. She oh, know it's that. like shackles. She gonna do whatever she want to do. When divorce court continues. Is Derek's drinking causing this marriage to fail? He was so drunk, he fell in the shower. Boop, boop, boop. He in the shower. Mr. Yeah. Mr. Davis, are you drunk? Falling all over the house? If you would like your case heard on Divorce Court, call us toll free at 1-877-311-2222 or log on to our website at divorcecourt.com and follow us on Twitter at Divorce Court. Divorce Court returns with the case of Derek Davis, who desperately wants to save his marriage of 23 years. He goes with this, ooh, baby, oh, I love you. Give it one more time, give it one more time, give it to one more time. It just, it just says, oh, and I'm like, I don't want it. I don't want it. He just like a mosquito. Uh. You know how a mosquito bites you? <laughs> she yeah. say that. And it just takes the blood out of you. That's yeah. how he is. She say that, but it ain't nothing she, she gonna do without me. Oh my, so, that's what he failed to realize. I tell him, give me one she more chance. Love it. Give, let me give me an opportunity to, to do it without you. She know she I can it. show she you and tell you. Leave it. She just talking cause she got a mile. That's right. all. <laughs> and he do too. Now, we both. as you leave, you would like to be reimbursed for some, some furniture. Yes, okay, well. That he, he tore up when he, when he was drunk. Drunk, oh, he tell drunk me about that. Oh, when he was drunk, oh, he'll just, you know, like, for that example, was, me and my daughter, we was uh, uh, he we was in the room and she had came over there and he had came home and he was so drunk he fell in the shower. Every time we heard it was like boop boop boop. He in the shower. He's so drunk. You know, and then it's like well, as if like in uh, my living room in my living room I have a coffee table. It was right. it was glass. Mm -hmm. Boom, drunk. First of all, Mr. You're... Mr. Davis, are you drunk? Falling all over the house? He's a drunk. Hey, I, 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 I tell you, okay, I've been, I was in the Army for six years. You were in what? The Army. The Army, okay. Yeah. And so, in the Army, we, we drank hard, you know. Mm -hmm. So, I kind of followed that, you know, from the Army to <laughs> out here. And Brought it on back with you. There you go. But, I don't drink like that no more. You know, I, I used to drink real hard. 
you know, and I changed my life now. Uh, uh, and no, he, I, he, I he. drink only, only, only on the weekends now. And, that, and so you know I, what? That I weekend might... make up for that whole week. Because <laughs> then too, he just uh, like uh, stumbling and blocking and everything else. And then he's, anno he's annoying drunk. Right. Leave her, leave her. What, your, what, what? He's calling my name, but this is how he's saying, leave her, leave her. No, I'm, and then his breast smelling just like alcohol. I'm like, go to sleep. Leave her, <laughs> but leave her. Oh, yeah, I tell you, I, I know all of them. Oh. Yeah, what <laughs> With that voice and that face, you remind me of Bernie Mac. Oh, <laughs> Bernie Mac. And that's right there. And he's a broke Bernie Mac. Uh, he's Mac. a broke Bernie Mac. Bernie Mac. Bernie Mac. <laughs> When Divorce Court continues, what will Judge Lynn have to say about the future of this marriage? 23 years with this brother. He may be a little drunk and stumbling on the weekends, but otherwise he's working, he's coming home, he's got a sense of humor, he's good looking, and he loves you. Don't be a fool. Divorce Court returns with the case of Alicia Burney and Derek Davis, who are considering divorce after 23 years of marriage. Let me tell you something. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I'm going to advocate on your behalf right okay. here, right now. Don't interrupt me because I'm going to go, and I'm going to go on a roll and try to get you your woman back, Mrs. <laughs> Burney. Don't be a fool. 23 years with this brother. He may be a little drunk and stumbling on the weekends, but otherwise he's working, he's coming home, he's got a sense of humor, he's good looking, and he yeah. loves you. Hey, yeah. Mrs. Bernie, when you go, when you, I'm gonna tell you. The grass is always greener. Oh, yeah, Every time, you know, don't be a fool. Don't be a fool. 23 years, he's a keeper. I see men coming in here and out here, women chasing them around. They got other baby mama drama and all this kind of stuff. You got a good brother. There are not a lot of extra ones out there. You need to keep the catch you got. Treat him right. If you, you know, go to the gym, find something to do. It'll be all right. But keep that brother, because he loves you. Thank you, dear. Thank you. Big money, you gonna try? <laughs> I just love me more. Do you really want to get this $350? Yes. Because first of all, he said up the well, house. Well, well, tell me about it. He texted me, you know, tell him, you know what, as if, you know, I keep my house junk or whatever. And I have a picture, yeah. Now, this is something he broke? Like, uh, well, no, this is something I had to replace for him where he broke. The living room table, I had to replace that. He bro It was glass. He broke that. Oh, the two did end he go through the glass table? Uh, no, uh, I think I picked it up and threw it. <laughs> One of my, you know, Drunken states. So you picked it up and threw. Are uh -huh. you a, are you an angry drunk? No, sometimes no, he can. No, I, but I don't. You know, I I touch stuff instead of touching somebody. So it's it's like that. I I've never put my hands on her. So the three hundred fifty dollars is for the table that he my turned table, over. My table, my end tables. Uh, uh. When did he do this? Less than a year ago. I don't know. You don't remember? Cause he, he don't, don't, know, what, I he don't drunk. know what happened. Yeah, I was drunk. I don't know. And he kept yeah. on well, saying. the he... next morning when you woke up, did you see broken glass? No, did you see I that cleaned it, it up. I, I usually, if some, you know, I destroyed it or something, I, I really, I picked it up. Oh, no, he don't. I, I picked it up, Your Honor. The way it was before. <laughs> How you gonna right, pick it up? He drunk. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah, but now he sobers up in the morning. And then he's up. It's cleaned up so he don't know. Mrs. And I tell him. Mrs. Bernie, I'm not giving you a dime. It what happened Thank a year you. ago. You. We don't know what happened. He probably replaced it. He's working. He's bringing home money. And all I can do is plead with you from the bottom of my heart. Keep this man. Keep this man. Thank keep you, this Yana. man. He's worth it. You, you ju just work with him. Just work with him. But don't lose him. There will be no recovery in this matter. Thank it you, is Yana. so ordered. All right. So funny. Parties may leave the courtroom. Derek reports that when he and Alicia got home, they kissed and made up. He says everything is going really smooth, and he and Alicia are very happy. They are looking forward to being happily married for years to come.